Hi everybody, I am a gamer mom, and today we are back with Frambo. I think we're getting close to the end. Just left a Thursta, and there's my pills on a string. My goodness, the door opened. Wow, interesting. Come on, Mr. Midnight, let's find out where we are. Oh, Fran. I hope we can find home soon. I'm starving. <clears throat> Mr. Midnight, look, we are at the other side of the bridge. Do you remember? The one we tried to cross before we fell into a thirster. Yes, I remember. Great. Let's keep on going, Kitty. We have to be careful now. Are these my pills? Wow. But... Where are they going? Mm hmm. Home. I guess home is in that direction. Mm, delicious berries. I wonder if those berries are good to eat. Pills! Don't move! Ah! Uh, you want to show me the way back home? Aha. Uh -huh. Oh no! I shouldn't have touched the pills. Bad friend. Bad. Bad. Ah, <laughs> uh, what should I do now, Kitty? We are trapped forever and ever. No, we're not. I still have the knife. Thud. Fran, you're already here? Well, I wasn't expecting you until, uh, 2.35. And as I see it, you are not trapped anymore. Interesting. Anyway, let me introduce myself. I am Itward, your faithful friend. Itward? Do I know you from somewhere? You seem familiar. Yes, I'm the creature of the night. We've been playing together. I helped you get Mr. Midnight back, you see. Really? Huh? I think I managed quite well to find my kitty on my own. Hey, aren't you the one that made the sisters mad? <clears throat> no. It wasn't me making the sisters mad. They believed it was me. <clears throat> you see? <clears throat> but that's because they never looked into themselves. What do you mean by they never looked into themselves? They blamed me instead of facing the fact that their parents never loved them. Oh. But let's stop talking about the sisters, shall we? Don't you recognize me, dear Fran? The long man with the top hat. I always came by night and told you stories when you were just a little baby. I came to you after you imagined me. But I'm not imaginary. You see, I'm part of your reality. Did I imagine you? You look quite familiar. Yes, I can't deny that. I exist because you exist. The truth is that you were able to imagine me because I already existed. That's some mental gymnastics there. Anyway, we don't have time to talk about this right now. Actually, I'm here to take you home. Follow me. Take me home? I can't let you do that. I don't know you. I won't hurt you. I'm not made out of darkness. I'm your friend. Mm, all right. You seem nice. I'll go with you, but I won't trust you yet. That's fine. Come on now. I have something to show you. You look like such a silly dorky skeleton. I love you already. Oh? Behold! The Itward flying machine. What do you think? It's alright, but can it really fly? Yes, with this gorgeous piece of machinery, I'll take you home. We'll fly as soon as I fix the details. Besides, it's not 2.35 yet. That sounds great, but 
What is it about 2.35, sir? I don't understand. It's when time becomes slower, and that gives us a chance to enter the Ultra Reality. Inside the Ultra Reality, we can travel wherever we want to go. Right now, we are standing on the endless limits of the second reality. But you are part of the third reality. Do you understand? Yes, I do understand. It sounds insane. <laughs> but sir, should I just wait until you are done fixing the machine? Wait, of course not. You can help by getting water and fireberries. Alright? Alright, it's better to do something than nothing at all, I guess. Great, here's my amazing handmade bucket for the water. I made it myself. My lovely. Ah, and the fire berries. You'll realize which berries to pick up because of the fire. Alright, but sir, can I just ask, why do you need the berries in the water? Ah, well, the berries are incredibly good fuel. They last many, many hours. And the water is the rid of the dirt. The Kamalas. Oh, Kamalas, I see. I hope they don't come around the flying machine. We never know, but we do know they don't like water. Yes? Oh, darling, I almost forgot. Your medicine. You need it. Some things are still invisible to your eyes, you see. Here. Thank you. Invisible to my eyes. Hmm. I see. Well, thank you. I was trying to catch the pills earlier, but the trap caught me first. Oh, yes, about that. I'm sorry. I needed to get your attention somehow. It's okay, sir. I defeated the trap in, like, one second. Anyway, I'll go get the fireberries and the water. I'll be right back. Great. I'll be preparing the machine. Go all the way back here and... Hello, shiny mister. Hello! Are you those shiny insects that get stuck on trees because of curiosity? We usually get stuck, yes. How did you know this? You are not one of us. I met some of your kind before. I helped them to get free from curiosity. Ah, that is very nice of you. Curiosity can lead us to unexpected situations. Yes, I think curiosity is a good thing, but... Are you stuck? Not at all. We, we're we just trying to make our hair the longest hair ever. Wow, that sounds amazing. Good luck. I have to go now. Bye. Oh, wow, so much hair and so shiny. Fireberries. Oh, the berries are on fire. It has to be the fire berries. Oh, can I climb you? Get out. Get out. You are trespassing on my territory. Huh? I excuse me. I thought you were dead. How can you possibly think that? You have no manners, young lady. I'm very sorry, but you seem to be all rotten and bloody. Me? Rotten and bloody? I think you are misunderstanding the situation. Why do you say that, Mr. Moose? Mr. Moose? But I'm not a moose. I'm a... Deadly worm. Excuse me? A deadly worm? No, no. Not a deadly worm. A deadly worm. I don't go around killing creatures. I just give back to the soil what creatures took from it and don't need any more. But I only see a talking moose. Where are you? Oh! Down here, creature. Can't you see me? Oh, there you are. You are so tiny. Hello, my name is Fran. Hello, Fran. Can I ask, why did you touch the moose in the first place? Normally, only scavengers would touch dead animals. Are you one? Of course not. I was trying to see if I could climb on it to reach the fireberries. I see. I think it is possible. The moose is still very sturdy and solid. But the fireberries are on fire. You can hurt yourself. Yes, I see. The fire. But I have to take them somehow. Good luck with that. Climb on now. I'll keep working. Thank you, sir.
I can't just pull them off with my hands. They are firmly attached. Yay! I got fire berries. Okay, now I gotta climb back down. All right, now water. Wow, so much hair and so shiny. Ah, uh, Camelot's ill. I look completely deformed. <laughs> Okay, water. What? Is there maybe water down there? There is water down there. Oh no, I can't reach the water from here. Uh, mister? May I use your hair? I need help, please. Would you me allow me to tie this bucket to your beautiful hair? Tie a bucket to our hair? Why, that sounds insane. Oh, it's not insane at all. I need water from under the cliff, but I can't reach it. I need to use your beautiful long hair as a rope. Please help me. All right, we'll help you. Tie the bucket real tight. Oh, thank you. You're very nice. Fill up the whole bucket, please. <clears throat> the bucket is now full of water. Aw, oh, thank you, shiny insects. I have to go now. I have to go home. Home is somewhere. We all wish to belong, but does home belong somewhere? What? I'm sorry, I don't... didn't really understand the question. It was a rhetorical question. I just wanted to say that you are your own home. Welcome yourself inside. You will find many doors to open. Oh, that sounds mysterious and beautiful. I'll try to do that some other time. Bye. Okay. Oh, bucket is full of water and it doesn't weigh anything? Uh, uh, sir? I got the water. Sir Itward, here's the bucket full of water. I got help from the shiny insects. You mean the Lucifans? They are nice, yes, but only when you see them in this reality. They're very dangerous if you ever see them in the fifth reality. They can burn you. Wow. Burn me? Well, I haven't been into the fifth reality yet. I don't recommend it. What's reasonable there may be the worst you'll ever experience. Oh, I forgot to thank you for the water. Thank you, Fran. I also have some fireberries. Sir, I brought the fireberries, but they are not on fire anymore. Magnificent. They will do just fine. Thank you very much, my darling. Oh, Fran, it's 2.34. The journey will begin. Let's go inside the machine. I mean, sure. All right, it would. Homeward bound. Ah! Flies! It's 2.36. We have a great possibility of reaching the target in good condition. That was a very fast two minutes. We'll soon be on our way to the third reality. Are you excited, Fran? Maybe I would be excited if I could understand more about the realities. You'll soon understand. The answers are not easy to recognize. Huh. That sounds strange to me, sir. Time goes as it has to in order for you to be alive. If it all happened now, you'd probably explode. 
Are you telling me that the answers I'm looking for will come to me when they want? Not exactly. You know what? I'd rather say, through time, you have to explore and experience to understand. This means the answers will come when you find them, not when others tell you how or where to find them. Ah, oh, I see. Well, I'm excited now. You woke up my curiousness. That's the best thing you can do for yourself. Be curious, and you'll always be amazed. But now, Fran, we have to get things done. Talking won't take you home. What things, sir? The machine needs some maintenance, and I think you would do incredible work. Here are the fireberries in the water you gathered before. Thanks. You'll need them to get the water pump working again and the fuel mixed. You'll find all information you need when you enter the room to the left. But feel free to enter any room you wish. I'll be quite busy fixing the automatic driver. But if you have something to ask, I'll be here. Mm, but I've never done anything like this before. That makes it more exciting. Have fun, my darling. All right, I'll go now. But push the button. Go in. Kitty! What's this? Wow, that's a huge spinning top. Oh, yeah. Fire in the bottom. Plug it in. Turn it on at the water. So water goes here. Okay, and then I would put a match in here. Flowers. We need a pencil. I don't need it. Test tubes. Look at this mess. It would doesn't know about hygiene. Okay, so what's this? Royal reality view. Unreality view. Chemical mixture. Oh. Okay. Oh, this looks like a mathematical problem. Oh, so many pages to read. I hope they have pictures. Feels like something is missing. A key. Okay. Many things to look at. The lamp looks like a teapot with forks and spoons. Lovely bears, they hold each other's hands. Mini shoes, maybe they are too tight for the big it, but a clock. I feel like I have to find tape or something. Uh, wait, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Tape. 
Duct tape is always good to fix stuff. Do I need anything else? Huh, a feather. Like the great wizard's brittle. Music? This music makes me think of forks? Okay. Uh, tape. Okay, well. There. Tape. There. Nutrients and fire berries will supercharge an engine and ensure it lasts forever. Fire berries are the AFM. Okay. So AFM A18. AFM A18. Two PF and R fifteen. Two PF and two PF and R fifteen. And then the hoses need to go how? An N one N one Okay, so I need to put that one doesn't fit there. Uh, okay, okay. And then this one goes here then. Here? for sure that something is working. Right. Right. Okay, good. Oh. Uh. Missing a hose somewhere?
Okay. There was a hookup somehow, but it's hooked, isn't it? It is hooked. It's hooked. Flip that over. This needs to be like this. That needs to go over. Okay, so this needs to be this way, and this needs to be like that. Yes? Woo! How do? How do? Uh, it's burning quite a lot. That's good. Maybe here. I think I'm missing a hose, maybe? See what in here. Oh, the ladder leads to a door, but it's closed. Uh, Mr. Itward, sir. Sir, can you tell me again what I was supposed to do? Sure, get the water pump working in the fuel mix. Just follow the wall newels. It's like a manual, but on the walls. Well, I did. But okay, so that I'm pretty sure I got done. All the berries, all the different things. From here. From here to wait. I feel like I need one more hose, but where is it? this machine does I don't think it's the right time to play a video game oh this is very complicated Interesting. Is there a hose? I wonder what kind of things this machine counts. That's King Zia. I recognize him. Tiny gloves. They look a bit familiar. 
Oh, were those yours when you were a little smaller? Friend? I don't... <sighs> it, it would say something about wall newels. Pretty sure Why Palantras gave me this? I can't open it. Um, uh, it word. I need more hoses. Red out. Yes. Well, those are both green. Maybe one of those isn't right. A eighteen. PF A eighteen two PF R15 and 166 R R N AFM which are the fire berries of Yuga AFM I didn't even think about this. Ah, uh, hello. Seconds and minutes and hours and days. Uh, 
Oh. Should check everywhere. <laughs> Okay, I love it. Twins. Are you... Are you here to kill Itward? Hello? Why won't you talk to me? I think this hose is what I needed. Okay. Victor. Use the other reality. Wait, no. Here. Now use this hose, which goes like... There. Yes? A18. One at a time. A eighteen. Yes. Maybe I have to be in this reality to get it to work. PF an R an N Spinning top, maybe the engine, compass goes in circles. Uh, let's just say I did it. Except it should be. No, there's got to be at least one more hose that I'm missing. Right there. Okay. I think it's done. Super Chemistry Master Fran Bow. Fran, I finally managed to fix the automatic driver. Do you need help? I think I've managed myself quite well, too. I did all you asked of me. Very well, Fran. Everything seems to be working perfectly. Yes, everything looks absolutely great. What should we do now, sir? Well, I wanted to ask you if you are afraid of rabbits. There's a little rabbit in one of the rooms, and I'm... I'm deeply afraid of it. Would you like to help me get rid of it? A rabbit? I guess it depends on the rabbit, sir. With all things I've seen, I just can't just imagine what kind of rabbit. Is it a chocolate rabbit? The one with horns and killer eyes. You'll have to see for yourself. It has a pink nose and blue boots. It's just sitting there. No blinking. No movement. It's staring all the time. It does sound very scary, sir, but show it to me, otherwise I will never know. Brave you are, dear. Follow me now. Okay. 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 There. See, it's just sitting there. Isn't that strange behavior? From what I see, it's just a toy, sir. It won't move. 
Would you please try to make contact with it? I don't dare to touch it. All right, sir. I'll take the rabbit and show you there's nothing to be afraid of. See, it's just a fluffy rabbit. Nothing to be afraid of. Oh, you're right, Fran. There is nothing to be afraid of. What? Don't go! Mr. Midnight! This is not funny. Take a carrot. That'll make me feel better, I'm sure. Uh... Uh, th uh, thank you? Th thank you. The bulbs don't know whether to stay turned on or off. Green leaves? I don't need more carrots. I already have one. Th three. Three. Two. Four. One. 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 Hello. Are you it was of the head? I like the hat. Okay, so that's eight. Eight to the right. to the right, five to the right, eight to the right, five to the right, eight to the left, six, eight, five, eight, six, eight, five, eight, six, nine. Oh. Uh, apparently I'm taking a wrench. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, okay. battery and it works awesome eight five eight six nine right right left right left So what did that do? Mr. Midnight, say something. Please don't take my kitty away from me again. Eight, five, eight, six, nine. Eight. Eight. I can't do 
Okay. I see an opening up there, but I can't jump higher. Hmm, I wonder what's outside. Uh, okay. But how... Oh, why did you scare it would? Anyway, you are very cute. Don't need it, okay. Okay. Oh, a mechanical rabbit is not very cute. Whoa, a mechanical arm. Are you alive? Can I pull this down? We have all the power we need. How do I get the arm to go down? to see behind you again, bunny. Hmm. Need this box to come down. I think it likes to push buttons. Battery is working. I'll leave it alone. Okay. It's a lovely little tree. Carrot. So, eight to the right, but I can only go three. Have 
I just had to get out of that reality. Oh, it's a symbol. I guess this is connected to somebody. Hmm. Are you... So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, five. One, two, three, four, five, eight over. Wait, no. Right, right, left, right, left. Eight, five, eight, six, nine. Eight, eight, five, six. Ding, damn it. Four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Got it. Hello. There's nobody in there. All right. Is there a light? I am Confucius. Okay. Now water. Is this to make music with the wind? Hello? Surprise, Fran! Happy birthday! Oh, a birthday party? Whoa, I thought you wanted to kill Mr. Midnight. You lied to me. We lied to you in order to keep your attention in another direction. I'm very sorry I had to fool you, my friend. We wanted to surprise you, my dear Fran. Come and eat cake. Alright, thank you, Kitty. You really surprised me. Thank you, Itwood, sir. 
cake is made of all ingredients you like. Mr. Midnight told me which ones. And we have something very special from you, from all members of the ship. That means all of us naturally more born or handmade beings. Here you go. I hope you find it educational. Wow. I love the wrapping. Can I open it now, please? Yes, go ahead. Open it. Aww. It's a little kitty cat doll. Wow, a cat doll. Aww. Thank you so much. I love it. It's beautiful. It may give your eyes new perception. You know, like the ultra reality. Is that what happens when I take the red pill, sir? Is the ultra reality what I see? Well, it depends. Would you like some explanations? Yes, please. Look. What you've seen is a mixture of different realities. And the old reality is like an invisible room where everything exists at the same time. For example, at this exact coordinate of time and space, we're having a birthday party. But in the old reality, other things are happening all the time. Slower, faster, or just invisible to the human eye. It's because of time, humans can define past, present, and future. Defining things encapsulates reality gives humans a chance to understand their environment. You have a different perception of the environment. It's not linked to definitions. Do you understand what I say? I'm not sure, sir. I think, maybe, I feel a bit dizzy. Ah, <laughs> that may be the ship going up and down. Blow on the candles now, dear. We're about to reach our destination. You mean we are about to get home? Did you hear that, kitty? Yes, we are about to arrive. Really? Wow. How exciting. Alright, here I go. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, dear. What's happening? Mr. Midnight, are you alright? I'm alright, but I hope the ship won't break. It sounds dangerous. Fran, you have to help. I have to drive the machine again. The automatic driver was destroyed by the Camelas. There is one left alive. You have to get rid of it. Find it. Fast. How do I do that, sir? Water. That cleans the dirt. Hurry up now. Remember, it may be hiding from your eyes. Oh my goodness, Kitty. I'm scared. Me too, my Fran. We have to find the Camela. I really hope the water destroys it. Let's go. Well... I already got the water. Let's look up here. Is it up here? No. Is it in here? No. Hi, girls. Then it must be in here. Ah, uh, and I have water. Gotcha. Ah, uh, don't run away. Where are you going? Up. It went up, which is good because there's more water up there. There you are. I... Yep. Aha! Gotcha! Almost. One more. Gotcha! Work. I gotcha. I think I finally got rid of the Kamala. I'm the best. I should go back to Itward. Okay, let's go back to Itward. Get rid of the twins. 
I did it, Edward. It would, sir. We did it. The Camilla is gone. It's gone, yes, but it's too late, dear. I can't take you home. We are going down. No, please, don't tell me this. It's not fair. No fair. I will always take care of you, my dear. Aww. And the ship was going down until it crashed. Everything was destroyed. The end? That is a very sad ending, Itward. Tell me another story, please. Alright. This is the story of Fran Bo and me. And she promised never to forget me or about the magic of everything. Hee <laughs> hee, I promise, Itward, I'll never forget you. Good. Now, it's time to sleep. Expect me in your dreams, my friend. Aww. Aww. Oh, chapter four. Part two, the doctor's prescription. Well, that feels like a good place to end this. Aww, hi little dear. So, we will find out where we go from here in the next video. If you liked it, leave a like down below. If you have anything to say, go ahead and leave me a comment. And like always, don't forget to subscribe for more content and I will see you guys all later. Bye!